You guys are going out tonight to celebrate Lady Gaga's birthday, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, big night. Big, big plans, big plans. Yeah. Chef Brian Olenjak from Olenjak's Grill is here. Thank you so much for being here, and congratulations. Seven years now. Seven years, uh, seven in years. In Arlington, congrats. Well, I, I appreciate that. I appreciate it. It's been a, it's been a long road, but we've, uh, we've made it, and it's been a, it's been a fun road, though. Yeah, so many changes, I mean, over the last seven years, especially for that, that Lincoln Square area of, well, of Arlington. You know, we've, we've got this big stadium just down the street, right. so it actually, it's beneficial to us. <laughs> right, so. right. And we're going to talk about a promotion you've got yes. for the Final Four coming yes. up. But first, what are we doing today? We are doing fried green tomatoes. Ooh. We've got a little bit of a remoulade sauce, and we're going to make a little bit of a corn and uh, tassel ham relish to go with it. Okay. Wow. So what I've got, I've got two different, uh, uh, I've got a wash, which is buttermilk, a little bit of uh, paprika, salt, pepper. I've got a breading, which is cornmeal, uh, breadcrumbs, salt, pepper, and also a little bit of garlic powder. And so what we're going to do is put the tomatoes in there, sliced green tomatoes, let them drip off a little bit, put them in the batter, or actually into the breading. And what is it about the green tomatoes? Why, why does everybody like to fry those? I'm a well, fan you know, of red everyone, ones myself. Everyone likes red tomatoes, which is pretty common, just mm -hmm. like you. But the thing is, is that green are firmer. Mm -hmm and have the same flavor so you're able to do things with them like oh, fry them okay. and so forth okay. so so it's easier to work with yes they are much easier to work with okay. so once i have them breaded put them in the pan and at work at, at, at the restaurant you put this probably in a deep fryer uh we do we have one that's got just pure uh corn oil in mm -hmm. it that we do with it so it, it actually gets a nicer flavor to it um, the oil here is about 330 degrees, and we let it fry for about three or four minutes, and then we pull it out, and we will make the, the little bit of a relish that we have okay. to go with it. And if you want to do yeah, it, pour sure. the corn. 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 Got it. We've got some, oh, that's the here. tasso ham. Oh, yeah. What kind of ham? Tasso. tasso. It's actually, it's, a, it's cured. It's more of a Creole ham. Okay. Got some cilantro. And all this? Yes, all okay. of it. All the cilantro? All the cilantro. We've got some jicama. And then we've got some roasted poblanos. Yeah, we're just gonna scoop that all together. Yes. So if you want to stir that up, I put a little bit of salt, and pepper, and then a little bit of lime juice. Oh, wow, that's pretty. And that's going to be the topping to the to the fried green tomatoes. And then we've got a little remoulade, classic remoulade that we make. Oh, that looks good. Yes. Voila. And here, our tomatoes are cooking, getting a nice little brown. I'm gonna do is flip them over here. So the final fours coming to uh, Arlington. We've got the final four. We've got Rangers opening day coming up. We've got a bunch of different events coming in. We're looking forward to. Right. So you think you, you're, you're going to be doing this big promotion. It's complimentary valet yes. parking and a, a shuttle to the final four NCAA. We do final. that for any event that's at the stadium. Oh, really? So we that's do the, cool. the, the valet and the shuttle. It's, it seems that our customer base and then people coming to the stadium really, really enjoy right. that. Really taking so. advantage of your yes. great location. Mm -hmm. yes. Okay, we're going to plate these up real quick here. We've got a recipe and a link to uh, Olin Jack's Grill at Arlington's uh, Lincoln Square on myfoxdfw.com. We're going to see what it looks like when we put it all together and check the weather forecast in just a moment.